Welcome to the Upper Peninsula Late Show. My name is Beaver. Oh, <laughs> you can call me Beaver, but my name is Arnold Fisher. On this show, we will cover news stories from the Upper Peninsula, as well as events from all around the whole wide world. You can find the Upper Peninsula Late Show on the internet at Twitter. If you follow us at Upper Late Show, you can like our tweets, you can follow us on the Twitter, and you can even retweet the jokes we post. Welcome to the Late Show from the Upper Peninsula, where cold isn't only something you have, but it's something you are. The Department of Natural Resources is encouraging snowmobilers to refrain from using loud exhausts. When reached for comment, one snowmobiler said, Huh? An unwanted subject was found in the Kingsford High School and Middle School complex. The subject has been identified as climate change science. Queen City Running Company held a Reindeer Dash on run to raise money to help the Upper Peninsula Foster Closet purchase shoes. If you have a little extra cash, please make a donation. It will be good for your soul. So visit www.upfostercloset.org as you can see on the bottom of the screen if you would like to donate. The Upper Peninsula Late Show is brought to you by Gun and Pawn. Trading guns for other belongings, just like when America was great. January is hot tea month, but you didn't hear that from me. The government reopened after a 35-day shutdown due to a failed agreement for a border wall on the U.S.-Mexico border. All President Trump wanted for Christmas was a wall, and all he got was increased business for coal. Michigan's new budget includes $20 million in grants to improve access to rural broadband. One rural resident exclaims, The Upper Peninsula Late Show is brought to you by Gun and Grocery. What good is protecting your family if they have an empty stomach? Microsoft co-founder Paul Allen passed away. Before passing, he was quoted in an interview as saying, <laughs> President George H.W. Bush passed away at the age of 94. He desired a world that was open to America, but left in America that was closed to the world. In high school sports, the Marquette Redmen edged out the Gladstone Braves in mascots that should be changed. The Milwaukee Bucks are currently the top team in the NBA's Eastern Conference. When asked about their chances to win the championship, local hunters give the Bucks a good shot. The Upper Peninsula Late Show is brought to you by Gun and Gun. Don't bring a knife here if you want to start a fight. Thank you for watching this episode of the Upper Peninsula Late Show. Until next time, you can follow us on Twitter at Upper Peninsula Late Show. You can follow us, like us and retweet us. You can even do a quote retweet. This has been the Upper Peninsula Late Show where we believe in building bridges. See how many people are following the blog. Alright, I don't know. I'm going to go to web. My web crawler and see when the next Gus Macker tournament is. Probably should send it. Send a hotmail to somebody. Oh,
ਤੁਸੀਂ ਲੈਣਾ ਹੀ ਹੈਗਾ ਮੈਂ ਸਮਝਾਉਂਦਾ